After months of ducking from Dillinger's El Primero El Parca, he will finally go one-on-one -on -one against his former best friend in a street fight in the six. And there you have it, Jason Sensation. Friends falling out is never fun to watch. But I gotta tell you, this has been a car crash on legs ever since El Parker turned his back on Mark Reese and joined that snake Dennis Dillinger at Resolution 15. I don't know that you can get that shirt on OCWshop.com, but you might not want it because this thing is going to be violent. Oh, you could definitely get that shirt at OCWshop.com if you type. If you type uh, uh, El Parker, you get 50% off on checkout. Cause we, we love you like that. Definitely get grab it as soon as possible. Got to share whenever possible. But this is this has been brewing, and what better what better place than the end of the season? El Luchador, the Campeón, El Primero, El Parker taking on his former best friend, the one half of the tag team champions, Big Country. Mark Grease in a street fight in the six. I hope I said that correct. Did I say that correctly, Jake Allen? <laughs> you got it, boss. That's where we are. Go. We are in the six. And you hear the cars start, and we are revving up for a street fight, baby. It's not Leon's car, that AVI. Mm. It's big country dot gift, baby. Mark Reese, as you mentioned, one half of the tag team champions. He himself is the holder of the record for longest consecutive tag team championship reign. Unfortunately, he's had to do it with two different tag team partners, and that is due to El Parca's heinous attack at Resolution 15. And now is finally the chance, after months of running, after months of words, after so much disposition, Mark Reese is going to get his hands on his little buddy. He deserves it. I love Mark Reese. You are not alone there. I think everybody loves Mark Reese. And you sold out chance raining down from the arena here with oh. Kenny Young. The immediate Mark Reese getting a little overzealous. It wouldn't be a street fight without some jeans, boss. Would not Look be. out. Oh, Jesus. He got countered. 100% definitely not a street fight without, without jeans and cowboy boots, baby. One could call this a Nebraskan bunkhouse brawl, but we are in Canada, so I, I guess that's not apropos, but back to that. It depends on, depends on where you're watching, but if you're watching oh! live here in Bank Arena, home of the Toronto Raptors, we're going to see a lot of claws, a lot of, lot of damage here in the street fight. We've got titles on the line for the rest of the night after this one. But for right now, look oh. at this. Oh, my God. A savant kick to the face. That steel chair. And Mark Reese not to be outdone. He's going to get right back on top. He, he grabbed the chair and got kicked in the mouth. It happens sometimes. But it is wrestling. And I appreciate El Parker wearing knee pads Ooh. under his, under his uh, uh, cut denim, denim uh, pants. Love to see it. He Going is to the high end district. That that was probably yeah. a Dennis Dillinger decision. Oh, the double stomp does not connect. Mark Reese keeping that, that flannel vest oh. on. And it doesn't matter. He can still slam you even with the flannel. The flannel slammel. The flannel slammel, Hoot. I mean, you said Dennis Dillinger called him an asset, but some people will call him an ass. Oh. And now a nice. stalling suplex from Mark Reese. We may be in the home of the Toronto Raptors, but we put it down like the 90s oh! Utah Jazz. Stockton to Malone and talk about a slam dunk on the back of that chair. 
He got the end. He got the side of that chair. That's got to not feel pleasant. You can see El Parker kind of grimacing a little bit in his eye, not his face. You can't see his face. He's a luchador. Uh, he wants to go face. get some toys. Goes by many monikers. Manuel, El Primero, El Parka. Parka, oh, dose straps. Oh, God. But Mark Reese called him little chat. buddy for over a year as Lucha Country reigned as the tag champions after securing it in the tag team classic last year. Nobody thought it would end like this, but here we are at the end of season 16. And these two are delivering on the violence. Oh, They're boy, definitely. up into the fireman's carry position. Oh, oh, my Lord, the knee. Big knee. Oh, oh. big centaur between the Chan and the Kendo stick, the Mexican beef stick. Oh, on another, on the churro. One. another one. <laughs> on the churro. Goddamn. Mark Reese, churro and all. Two centons after that gut buster. The spot fest giving us everything we wanted. My God, no. Mark Reese not even waiting. For El Parker to get to his feet, just slapping him with that Nebraskan beat stick, boss. There you go. Oh, it came up with the drop kick. It still landed. See, good thing he had those knee pads. Didn't hurt himself he on does, that chair. Oh he God, he's trying to fight for his kick. life. Elbow to the back, to the, to the back of the head, to the ear of Mark Reese. Reese with the counter. What does he have in mind? Now? He's got Parker on the back oh. of his head and a shot to the face. No room breaks in this one, baby. Here's the cover. No. When they when the, the, their first interaction, Mark Reese was taking El Parker to task, and El Parker opted out and hit him right in the, you know, hit him right in the uh, 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 the chimney. Right in the haystacks. Well. Yeah, right in the haste, right in the giant haystacks. Now <laughs> those giant haystack shots are no, are totally legal, but that also uh -oh. means that he can't end the match that way either. But he's thinking of being creative. Oh, oh boy! God. Oh, is he going to be able to lift them? Yes, he is. On display the of El Parker oh! and knocked down. Oh my oh, God! That table. Corner. On the corner, who? That table just absolutely exploded here at ringside. The cover is not enough, though. Mark Reese is able to kick out. Goddamn thing evaporated into a million billion pieces. That was crazy. I'll be the first one to tell you that I love wood, but Mark Reese is definitely not in favor of that right now. He is back to his feet, though. Clubbing blow to the back. The ladder has now entered the mix, and some technical skill, some pro wrestling has uh, devolved from this street fight. Some good old fashioned pro wrestle wrestle. Now whipping oh. into the barricade. Oh. We're right. We're right back to the environmental usage, and Mark Reese is going to take his business inside the squared circle. This has been like what three, four months in the making. This has been a long time coming. This ass whooping to El Barber. This has been almost two years in the making since Lucha Country formed. And had their, had their first championship match with CQC. They came up short there, but they didn't come up short very much Ooh, at all after oh, that. Even, even when El Parca decided to turn his back, they were victorious in that Bermuda Triangle. El Parca did indeed sell out. Right now, Mark Reese isn't selling much of anything as he will not go down. He's a big boy. There, yeah, finally, he goes oh. down. That's a poison rana. That poison rana is very dangerous and poison. Uh -oh. oh, Mark Reese is pissed. He oh, sure boy. is. Ti it's time for slamming, and there's that vintage Mark Reese kip up. Vintage Reese, like, just like you said, and he's feeling himself. He's getting charged up. Charging up his laser beams. We have seen some phenomenal street fights, some phenomenal safety matches in season 16. Matches like Pew versus Mugen come to mind. Matches like <laughs> Mugen versus Court Marshall at Summerside. These have a, Mugen these versus have a lot everybody. To to. Yeah, Mugen. Yeah. Uh, let's just let's just say Mugen. Yeah, Mugen versus H two O. Basically, We're whatever safety is involved, it's basically just Mugen and somebody else. And right now, it is a lot more serious than it is with one half of P three and Ooh. one half of the Platinum Plutonic Brothers. There is nothing Plutonic about these two relationship. And now Mark Reese, we've seen it once already. How about another swing? Wee! Wee! He's hitting the Oh top. my God. Oh God, he hit the ladder twice and the third time on the release. God damn. The cover now after the big swing. One, two, no, and it's not enough. El Parca coming off of his incredible CCW Championship match with Antonio Everett would love to get a victory and none more than against Mark Reese. Reese is setting up the ladder. Oh! oh. God damn. Savat kick to the face. We saw him catch one of those with a steel chair early in the match, and now he said putting that ladder down. 
You would think that the Luchador would want to engage in some nice Lucha things, but he's the one that throws that ladder down. Here is the cover after that flashback maneuver, and it only nets a two-count boss. At this point, El Parker is trying to survive. He needs to come up with some kind of strategy. He needs to come up with some kind of, uh, you know, assault pattern to take down Mark Reese because Mark Reese is coming. He's a big, countrified ass whooping. Waiting we for just El Primero. Put, oh, we just God. Put this table back together, oh. and El Parka wants to tear it down once again. There's an arm drag. Takes down Mark Reese temporarily. Literally put up the partition. Like, oh, God. These people are going to have to get another partition, aren't we? Good thing we pay our ring crew a lot of money, and Mark Reese showing do. off the power. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's oh gone. my God. Oh, oh my, my God. God. Oh God. Not again. Power slam on the monitor. Oh. Now oh, Terminator on the God. monitor. Get the oh hell out of here. Mark you Reese. He is Are you serious. As no, Nebraska he's, Friday. He's no he's way gone. he's getting up from that. No, he's no not. No way. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. I've never seen such a vicious side of Mark Reese. Well, we told you it was going to be violent. We didn't tell you it was going to be long, and that's why. Oh, my God. We need to get some help out here for El Parca. As much as I hate to say it, Mark Reese emerges victorious. He is now the champion, and he will walk away from Lucha Country happy as can be. Jesus Christ. We got to check. You said it. You got to check on El Parca. His, his chest and back might be caved in. We got more action for you. Can't condone violence, but goddamn.